pretty much because it can be pretty daunting, pretty intimidating. Yeah, it's very intimidating, you know, when you have all the coaches, you know, coming at you about doing this, but but you have to realize, you know, they're trying to better, you know, better your ability because you are the future, you know, coming in. So it's real hard out there not knowing anything. But, you, I mean, you learn by getting things wrong. I mean, that's kind of how the learning process kind of goes. But then again, you get called out in a meeting or something, you don't want to get something wrong. How do you kind of balance the two? You just have to stay focused, you know, on your goal, on, you know, doing what the coach asks you to do, you know, and the play pretty much. You know, that's how. Freshman year, I mean, do your expectations, I guess, heading into the year for you? Um, really, you know, hopefully, you know, make the budget. You know, right now, we're all out there competing. So, you know, I'm, I've am i been told, you know, I've been doing, you know, what I have to do, but I have to hustle more. You know, stuff like that comes together as you, from high school, you know, me, me coming from high school, I'm coming from the number one program in the nation, so we always hustle. You know, I kind of got lax of days out here. So I had to pick it back up. Do you feel playing time, there's playing time to be had for the season for someone like you? I don't know, you know, I'm still out there competing, so I don't want to talk too fast. How important, oh, I'm sorry, how important do you feel like the scrimmage is tomorrow as far as making an impression? Oh yeah, the scrimmage tomorrow is very important. I'm looking forward to it, you know. I'm just going to, you know, get a good night rest, you know, eat well, you know, study the playbook more, you know, just look and just see where I have to improve at you know, tomorrow. When a guy has a lot of high school success, do you feel like, you know, there's more eyes on you, like people expect, just because of a certain reputation or whatever, a certain a program's reputation? Most no, definitely, most no, definitely. Me coming from the number one program and me being a four-star recruit, you know, everybody looking forward to me doing this and doing that. When I do have weaknesses, you know, I do have, you know, abilities, which I can do, but at the same time, I'm coming from high school onto a bigger level and a bigger stage. You know, this place was the number one program, you know, yeah. not too long ago. How close do you think, now that you've gotten this view of it for the last few weeks, how close is it to getting back? Um, I think it's I think it's getting back well. You know, everybody's coming together. It seems like this team, you know, I've never been on a team like this, you know. It's just, it's crazy. You know, it wowed me much to see, you know, a bunch of guys, how, how close and how bond they all together, you know. So I think, it, I think it should be back this year. So you know you made the right call? Yeah. Definitely. Who have been some of the guys that you've learned from that you've, up and get the for you. Um, Johnson, you know, me and him, you know, that's like my big brother, you know, DeMarcus Van Dyke is like my big brother, Brandon Harris, you know, all these guys, you know, Sean Spence, Marcus Forsman, these guys, I look up these guys because I see how they carry themselves and I see how they play on the field, you know, it's always success when they go out there, you know, so all of them just, you know, simply, they, all of them like my big brother, you know, they take me out to eat, you know, do simple thing when I need something to do for me. This scrimmage tomorrow, how important uh, is it for you, you feel? It's very important, you know. I got to go out there and, you know, show, show, what I, show what I can do.